Hello there. I hope you had a good week. Now, today I want to give you an update on what is going on in East Congo uh, about the conflict in the eastern part of Congo between M23 rebels and the Congolese army. Now, let's face it. Most people believe that the Congolese army is struggling to contain the M23 rebel group. But in hindsight, in the background, what is happening is that the Congolese government is seeking to reverse the balance of power. And the government in Kinshasa has bought military drones from China and hired Romanian soldiers operating under the command of a former or ex-French foreign regime. In other words, the commander is a mercenary and these Romanian soldiers are mercenaries. So that's what is happening. Now, let's talk about these armed drones from China. News and verified information reaching us is that the Congolese government have acquired about 10 of these armed drones known as the CAS Rainbow CH4 or CSS Rainbow CH4. So these are Chinese armed drones that are very lethal, you know, very lethal. These drones, the, this particular version called the Rainbow CH4, is a new drone developed by the Chinese military. It has never been exported to any other country, like the previous drone they had called Wing Long 2, the one they sold to Ethiopia, and it was not performing as expected. The same drone was sold to you know, the Emirates, the UAE, and they tried to use it in Yemen, but that particular model never worked well. So the Chinese went back and made another type of drone, now this particular Rainbow CH4, and it is said to be a very lethal weapon, very precise and very good at doing its work. So that drone, uh, 10 of those drones are going to Kinshasa and they are going to be operated most likely by these foreign mercenaries. Because, you know, these guys work in for, uh, Western militaries, others worked in French foreign region and they operated such kind of equipment. So... Congo is using these mercenaries particularly to help them understand how to operate this type of system. And another information that I got, and these are verified information on the CIPRI website. You know, CIPRI is a, a website that tracks arms purchase. So since November last year, uh, the day Con Congo had their weapon ban lifted, you know, the UN had or the UN Security Council lifted this. Uh, weapon purchase ban on Congo, the one that has had been in effect since 2003. 